Hello everybody, Mr. Sixman here, and welcome back to Marble World. This is a marble run, and is an absolute monster. In fact, it's so huge, it might just be the biggest we've ever seen. It's made out of over 70 thousand pieces and it took over a whole year to build so today we're going to check it out to see how good it is link in the description below if you want to have a go with it let's get on with it You know you found a big marble run, don't you? When it's actually got its own car park. <laughs> That's how big this thing is. And as we zoom out here, I mean, look, this thing, guys, it's even got its own dock as well. And look at this big ship over here. This container ship alone is made out of over 4,000 pieces. Let's just zoom out, though, from this dock over here and have a look over there now. So over here, we've got a bay. It's got a house with a private jetty and a yacht on it. And just in case one lighthouse wasn't enough, it's actually three of those things <laughs> waterfalls go down the entire side of this marble run here's the very top there's tracks covered in snow and there's actually a ski lift over here this is not just an ordinary train okay i mean it's all handmade the whole interior has been made to look like a real train look how big it is guys the train is huge it goes all the way over there we really do need to find out where these marbles spawn in now so let's, i think it's over here by yes there they are look yes here's the garage there's two garages here spawn Whoa. Oh, oh, oh no guys the performance my, com my computer's blowing up okay here we go oh yes it's working oh, look at this they go down to the end here and whoa they're flying through the air hang on a minute whoa they're actually going up the Guys, you see that one that just catapulted off into space? These ones are flying right up to the top of the mountain through that ring. Look how high they're going. This is right at the top. Whoa, some of those marbles are going into space. They're coming from all of the way down there and then landing on the very top of this mountain. Yeah, they're going to start to roll down here. Look how many marbles we've got here. Where are these, where are these marbles? They're just landing on a tree. Did you see that? They're coming out of the shadow realm and landing on a tree and then... <laughs> I've got no idea what's going on. Over the bridge and under the bridge, there's a huge traffic jam building up down here. I think I just broke the game. Whoopsie. Right, let's try that again, shall we? Now, you might notice we've got some marbles on this track already. In fact, we've got 500 marbles. Let's go and continue from where we left off. Here's some more coming right now. They're going to hit the spinner and a booster pad, which throws them through this narrow gap, hitting some nails or pegs or whatever. And look at that. Here, they actually get split off into two different sides of the track, and they can go right or left. Let's go down the right-hand side first and see where they end up. So through these rings here look at that guys there's some garages on the side there's a recovery vehicle the forklift truck there's a car being serviced i think <laughs> look how big the spoiler is and the guys that's quite good that's got a lot of downforce that one i think now those horns on the front give it extra horsepower as well there's a van over here with a light on it we're just waiting for a few more marbles now and here they come they're going to rush down to the end around this corner and check this out one of my favorite things on the whole run is this big funnel here look at the entrance to it as well look at that they get a real kick kick of power when they come off the end and then get launched around the sides of it let's get a bird's eye view of that as well you can see how they go around the edge and then make their way of course into the center look at that bright blue marble in the middle that's pretty cool isn't it so they're all going to roll down into the center of course there's the dog marble and uh, let's follow them down through here and see where it goes next okay so oh oh okay now this is actually whoa <laughs> Guys, it's like spaghetti down here. It's like multicolored spaghetti, isn't it? Let's go down. Oh my goodness. So they're going to split off into four different tracks through the funnel. They're rolling down the tracks here into another funnel. They're going to go through the center of that one onto other tracks underneath that. And then they're actually going to fall into this real, this really big funnel at the very bottom of it and fall down the hole in the middle. Look up there. Look how crazy that is up there. Let's follow some of these ones down through this hole at the very bottom then through this funnel here 
and uh, see where they go next. Okay, we're now inside the mountain still. We're going to go, oh, three different directions we can go. Here's some more marbles coming through now. So we're going to go down the left-hand side here, all right, and follow these ones round, I think. Goodness me, guys. No, we're not. We're going to go down the middle. I don't know. We'll just follow this one, shall we? <laughs> down the middle. This goes over a jump there. There's some more marbles coming behind us as well. Whoa, they're going really quickly through this tunnel. We better hurry up to follow them. And, uh, okay, here we go. Still in the top. Okay, now we're going outside. Here's the fresh air again. And actually, and that's where we came out, look. But there's other marbles coming out up here as well. That's interesting. Oh, yeah, this is where the ski lift is. Look at this, guys. There's a ski lift over there. Let's follow this lava marble here. We're trying to wait for a few more marbles to come through. But, uh, okay, this one... It, well, where is this going? Okay, in a tunnel now. Whoa, this is awesome. And they're going to join together with another track, which probably was the other sort of side we saw earlier, where they split off. Let's go through this tunnel then. Here's some more marbles coming behind us under a log. And eventually, they make their way back outside into the fresh open air. Look at that lovely blue sky. As we come out here into the trees and the rocks, there's an elevator over there. Check that out. The marbles are coming off it, guys. They're actually riding up this elevator. And oh no, the marbles have got stuck here. Whoa, look at that in the background, guys. These marbles are flying. Wait, how did that happen? <gasps> here it is. There's a jump here. Whoa, look how high they're going through the air, guys. This is amazing. They're jumping up to that track. Right, we'll go there later, of course. But right now, we've got to carry on following this track, I think, into the other side of this mountain. In here, and I'm sure other marbles are going to pass us in a minute. Ah. And on the other end of that small tunnel, there's actually another funnel here, which is out in the open, by the way, as you can see. There's more marbles just behind us down there. But we're going to go down here, of course, first. Follow that really bright, bluey, green one there. And, uh, and let's see where they end up. So we're going to go out here again. Here they come, out and around the corner, back inside the tunnel. This is a really narrow track. Goodness me, where are they? Oh, okay, down here. Right, this is a very difficult track to follow. <laughs> They're going to roll through. They're heading into the rocks and everything. And this is the outside. But look at that. In the background, guys, the ski lift is in operation. And all of these marbles are actually climbing up. They're going skiing, guys. They're going down the slopes. But uh, <laughs> that's so cool, isn't it? Look at them there. The lift taking them up the top. But this is where we just came out of over here. So let's keep following this track down for now. We're sort of on a river, actually, aren't we? Going down the side of the mountain at the moment so there's water rushing water sort of like a rapids or something isn't it we'll follow this dice marble here it's gonna make its way through this challenging bit of track into another funnel which i suppose is made out of water oh hang on okay it's gone down this way We've gone through the funnel now around the corners in the tunnel Ah, now that's the escalator at the end. Okay, so let's quickly make our way right to the top of that. There's the top of that escalator. Let's follow them through into the mountain again, round the corners outside again, and they're going to join onto a track here, look. And actually, oh, that's interesting. Now, this is a really nice snowy and icy track. We've got these big barriers up on the side, look, keeping the marbles on so they don't fall off. So we're going to make our way around the corner here. Let's zoom out a bit and watch these things go down these S-bends. That is fantastic, isn't it? There's that tunnel that we were in just a minute ago. There's the ski lift over there. And this is where we are right now, going down this icy white track here, back into the mountain. And okay, now this is interesting. Well, there's a jump here. Wait a minute, I recognize this. Oh, look, this is where the track split off before, guys. We're back in here again. So we've sort of gone round in a circle, actually, I think. What we have to do now, though, is go down the left-hand side of this obstacle course track because they get split off, if you remember from before. Last time we went right, and they actually end up over in that big funnel over there, past the garages. But this time we're going to go left and actually just follow this sort of yellow and orange or red marble here as it comes around the hairpin bend, and then it's going to roll down this slope. There's a rainbow ramp over there between the rocks. It's going to roll through those. There we go, getting a bit of a boost while it does it and uh, around this hairpin bend as well 
and eventually, guys, it goes onto this jump over here. Whoa, look how high it's jumping. Now, we saw this a minute ago, didn't we? So, actually, this is the same part. Now, there's two tracks from here that it splits up onto. The snowy, icy track above, and there's also a tunnel the marbles can go in. We've actually been on the upper track a minute ago where it went back down into the cave again. We came out of this T-junction here. So, let's follow this marble hit. Whoa, guys, that <laughs> it went so high and it went down the tunnel. Let's quickly zoom down, and there's the world marble that's gone down the tunnel as well so let's quickly go through here and see where it ends up we go right to the end of it and oh no it's guys it splits off into two again this is so confusing okay let's zoom out here ah now that's good we've actually seen this before haven't we but as you can see the marbles that split up there can actually go onto the right hand side and they're going to go onto the ski lift over here so they're going to actually go on a ski lift and climb up the mountain okay so let's just join them here let's go down and have a good look at them there's the building where you can buy or rent the skis isn't that really cool guys and then we'll just sort of go down here as if we were riding up it. So here we go. There's a marble just joining us now. We're going to zoom up to the top. And uh, we'll just try and get up there pretty quickly. And watch these marbles drop off the end. Here they come. Dropping off the end of the lift now. And they're going to split up again into another two tracks. I'll do my best to sort of keep track of what's going on here. There's so many different tracks you can take. Now on the right hand side they're going through a couple of spinners. And also there's a red house over there. We're actually going to continue watching those marbles a bit later on. We're going to go down the left hand side right now. Because the ones on the right are actually joining on with another track from over there. Okay we'll see that later. Here's two more marbles. Let's follow them now on the left hand side of the ski lift track and uh, we're going to go down here really big winding bends and uh, they <laughs> must be skidding down there pretty fast guys that ice must be pretty slippery and they're going to go eventually into this little sort of section here with a red triangle spinner and some nails as well they're getting through those not getting stuck luckily they're going to split off into another two tracks here so let's see where does the one on the right hand side go that's going to go all of the way around these bends. There's so many tracks here to follow. Look in the background. There's the big orange bridge. Now we're going to follow them up here past the uh, the actual entrance to the bridge which is just underneath us right now and around the corner and look at that they're going to join back on to the ski lift track so they have to go around all over again guys let's follow the other side of that ski lift track though where it splits off but go left this time and see if that actually goes around at the beginning of the ski lift as well and we're going underneath it right now by the way there it is there's a marble we can follow that one so let's just uh, sort of zoom out a bit here and find out where this track goes so, okay, this is interesting, isn't it? Around the corner. Ah, oh, yes, we just came from here, didn't we? There's the exit of the caves. And you can see that if we just follow it round, it joins on back to the ski lift again. So both of those paths go back to the ski lift. Okay, so back here, we just went on the left-hand side out of the cave over there onto the ski lift. The right-hand side track actually joins up with this track over here. The next part, guys, is actually amazing, all right? So get ready for this. They're going to join up with those two tracks there, joining up into the centre merging into one track hitting some bumps and some really sort of sharp spikes here they're going to zigzag through those look at that but look at the view as we come out of this tunnel and if we just sort of take a step back that is a bridge and it's absolutely amazing look how big that bridge is it's really detailed as well it's got all the supports and everything and it's mind-blowingly good that so out here of course they're gonna go through those zigzag spikes and then they're gonna bash into these bounce pads and it's quite hard to get through there look they're oh my goodness guys it's really hard to get through there Oh, oh yeah, whoa. that one just made it through and some more as well just coming as well right so now let's follow these ones down here there's some roadblocks halfway and some jumps so let's see oh okay whoa guys that one just <laughs> it's a booster jump look how fast they're going off this jump here that pink one whoa <laughs> guys they're zooming past the camera there's some more pegs to bash into at the end of this bridge down here that one going really quickly down the side look at that and they're going to go off the bridge and go around the corners through these houses. Oh, oh, that's a rainbow jump. Oh, wow, that's really cool. Let's zoom out here a bit and see them. Oh, that is awesome, guys. And there's marbles underneath on a track below as well. So these ones on the rainbow jump are jumping over other marbles on a different track. Here they come again, jumping over the top and into a big cave or tunnel 
on the other side. Here come two more. We're going to watch these ones go over it and then follow them through. There we go. Into the cave down here. Now let's see where this goes. Interesting. There's a really small hole. There's a marble coming here. There's the world marble. Look, the whole world has just rolled through. <laughs> this marble run is so big that you can roll the world down it. <laughs> oh my god goodness what have we got here now wow okay unbelievable we've actually got a massive interior space here that is a colossal area inside the rock we've got a really nice what is this some sort of gear system going on that's powering something i guess and uh if we now there's a clock no way look at that it's actually it's going really guys time is really fast in this world for some reason <laughs> And there's pistons here going up and down. There's another big gear there spinning around. This is unbelievable. Oh, that's part of the track, look. Marbles are actually going down here and hitting into that spinning gear. There's one that, that's coming through. That's the dog marble going down the left-hand side. There's a bridge here. And, oh, look, it's broken. If these marbles are fast enough, and you can see there, look, they're going through, but they're not making it to the end of the bridge, and they're having to fall down the broken bit down there. But if they're quick enough, they can actually get over the top onto a different track let's see where these ones go and follow them so are any of them oh yes one of them got over guys let's follow this one then underneath the rock around a spiral which is going around one of those crystals then it's going to drop off and eventually ends up down the bottom here the blue star marble is also making its way up there's a oh, 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 oh. <laughs> there's a wooden marble there and uh, it eventually gets out of the top here actually there's another track in there as well oh look at this guys there's actually a vehicle in here it's got a massive drill on the end of it i guess that's what's been used to drill out this space inside the rock the engine's running look it's got smoke coming out of it that looks really powerful doesn't it also in the back Ground. there's a crane up here and it's actually lifting up some golden rings and uh, look you can see there it's a crane it's like a gantry crane and it can go left and right across the ceiling here are the ones that go down the bridge if they don't make it across though they're going to come down here past some nice crystals there glowing in different colors and they're actually going to go down the same oh, look at this guys i just saw a little marble over here it's got a hard hat on a radio and a mug of coffee as well just having a break from all the mining that they've been doing in this amazing space but all these marbles yes they seem to sort of go into this tunnel all together at the end one last look at this incredible place before we move on to the next part of this marble run here we go following these marbles through then booster pads zooming them up to the top and we'll just rush up there as quickly as we can out the top then oh no they're going to split off again guys into two different tracks here lots more marbles are coming up now so we'll just follow these around splitting off into two different tracks and then eventually exiting onto the same one over here through some spinners okay so they're going to make their way through those there's a switch here look oh that's interesting it is moving oh it's moved to the other side so these marbles are going to have to go down different routes and we'll just zoom out here so we can try to see what's happening now if you have a look at the right and the left hand side the blue area and the red area they're eventually going to meet up together and join back onto the same track so you can see these ones here look going through the blue house they're going to start to roll down these slopes here around the corners through the rocks and the trees there's some more marbles over there past these sort of small pools of water there's a big escalator in the back oh yes we're gonna have a go on this right now watch what happens as this purple marble here doesn't get quite to the end and it rolls back down the slope what they're going to do is come to a stop at the end and go through that gap down there over the water that's an awesome bit of track over the water there and onto an escalator they're going to queue up there look make their way onto the first step and then gradually get right to the top of the escalator and continue down this track here so we'll just follow these two red ones and see where they go through the rings here let's follow them down and around the corners past the trees and eventually look they just join onto this track here let's zoom out so you can see where they're going there's another one there just coming off the end joining on with other marbles onto this bigger track down below now there's some orange rings here and those rings are where the marbles come from if they actually get over this big sort of slope there 
Oh, that marble just made it across. And those rings, as you can see, are on that track where they joined back with this one over here. But yeah, they all join back onto the same track eventually anyway and continue down the marble run. Okay, so we just went down the blue side on the right. But now let's go down the red side on the left. And if we follow, I think there's some marbles just coming around now. There they are through the red gate. And they're going to go under a log onto this big bit of track here. And again, they're going to snake their way. Look at that house. That's pretty cool on the side of the slope there booster pads helping them get round and they are eventually going to end up with the track that we just saw a minute ago so we'll just follow these ones there's another couple of marbles over here look and there just around the corner is where the other marbles are that we saw earlier that is the point where they join back together again over here but there's one track we haven't seen yet which is actually the central piece and that is of course what happens if the marbles go onto the heart here in the center so let's try and see now there's a marble there on the left hand side of the heart but basically they both go into this crossroads here and then inside the rock so they all end up in that same central part let's go up to the top of the heart then inside it and see what happens let's go through one of these tunnels and see if we can follow the track through oh there's a marble there goodness me that gave me a scare it's like one of those jump scares in resident evil <laughs> Anyway, let's come through here, through the tunnel, and uh, there's the exit, and we'll just come through here. Whoa, look, okay, look at this, guys. Whoa, whoa, you see that? There's a, there's a building here full of bounce pads. Hang on, let's just get another marble to come down. Right, we've just come from there, guys. Look at this pink marble, though. It goes into this building and smashes into tons of bounce pads, which are inside that building, and then... And as you can see, whoa, and look at this, there's gaps here that the marbles can shoot out of. So we, oh, there's another, whoa, hang on, no, no, quick. <laughs> Okay, that is amazing. Here's another marble inside the building. There it goes, bounces out and goes down this track here. There's some marbles have been stuck in the middle. Look, guys, the best way to see what's happening here is to zoom out. There's the building we were just in a minute ago. It's flashing around now. That means there's a marble in there and it's about to come out. There it goes, a red one and a yellow one. They're going to go down these tracks here, three different tracks go around these bends now on the way there's actually some funnels they can drop into i suppose if they go the wrong way so that they've gone on the wrong track they're gonna have to go down here and i don't know what actually happens but let's follow these ones through and whoa okay this is a oh my goodness this is a big spiral here i'm doing my best to go through quickly and uh Oh, we've gone out again. Ah, and it just came out here, look. So actually, they all join back onto the same track eventually if they fall down the funnels. I want to see what this middle track does. It's really interesting because there's a big jump it goes up over here, guys. Check this one out, right? It goes up this really big slope. There it is. Up the jump, around the corner. Oh, nice. Nice, and it spirals down here, look, and again, drops back onto the same track. Okay, so they all make it into the same area. Let's see how this marble does getting past the audience here. The crowds of people cheering them on, and it makes it through right down to the end, into the cave here. Let's follow them into the cave. Now, this is where all of the marbles, oh my goodness, this is where all of the marbles join together when they finish up on that track. And I'm guessing... They eventually join up with the other ones we saw earlier. Uh, oh, they're going to go under the bridge. Oh, that's interesting. And that tunnel there where this marble's coming now, that's where we just came out of. And look at that. Right down below us is the track that joins on that we saw earlier. Okay, where they all merge together. So now they're going next to each other. But look at this. There's actually a bridge up the side of this track. And we're going to follow this marble down right now and see where that goes. So through these little sort of houses here, and uh, oh my goodness, that is incredible. Let's just see if we can zoom ahead. Now, where are we? There's the rainbow jump. We're right next to that at the moment. Let's take another bird's eye view then of this section and sort of make our way over to the right. There's one now, a white marble going through this section of the track, through the really thin parts. And up here, you'll notice there's a switch track. It's going to go here, look, just coming around the corner now. And it's going to hit the switch, which changes and sends it that way at the moment. But of course, marbles can go in lots of different ways through here. We're going to take a bird's eye view view now look how complicated this section is through the trees and the rocks and there it is just down there but what happens is they end up 
all over here at the bottom of this section very shortly we're going to see that marble that we were watching there it goes there is see that is quite hard to see because it's white but it comes out goes down the funnel in the center and of course four tracks there's a pink one and a blue one four tracks are joining on all together into that funnel and then out this area at the bottom and there's another really really big track guys look how big these tracks are winding round down the side of the mountain now we must be getting guys okay i thought we were quite low on the marble run but we're still really high up look how much there is left to do guys there's marbles all over this thing but we're following these marbles down right now the pink and the blue one there they are we saw them a minute ago let's keep following them down around these corners here oh no <gasps> look at that there's actually a moving block here and oh they got knocked by it they've gone this way oh no guys look, they're going across the bridge actually that's amazing whoa we're going past the trucks interesting okay so past the trucks all of the way across the bridge <gasps> what's here oh no where are they going oh no guys are they, are they, what, what hang on hang on here they are here they are oh no are they, oh, are they, are they going, are they going back on? They've gone back onto the track. Quick, follow them. Here they come. Oh my goodness. They actually went out into space and then came back again, I think. Okay, they're going to roll down the side of the mountain here now. And, uh, oh, that, one of them got stuck, I think. Oh no, it's come out here. Look, it's joining the blue one. Goodness me. We're right down at the bottom or near the bottom of the marble run now. Coming around the corners. And we'll just see they're going to join onto this track. We're near the docks, by the way. And there's the uh, sort of an archway. Oh, my goodness. Oh, I can't see. Or oh, they've gone into a... <laughs> they've actually gone into there, guys. It's uh, it's a teleporter. Let's go through here and see what... Oh, whoa. Oh, that's the underneath, guys. We're, we're right underneath the track. I've gone into link mode, and I'm a bit worried my computer might blow up. But if we just follow this laser beam, it's going to show us where the teleporter leads to. And it's all the way over here. Oh, my goodness, guys. What is actually going on? Hang on a minute. Let's just turn that off. What is actually going on here? Oh, my goodness me. Are they, the marbles are going through these tubes. Whoa. Hang on a minute. Oh, look. They're going to come out here. That's amazing. They actually... Now, there's not many marbles coming through here, so we might not see any. If I've got that right, that's where those marbles are coming out from. But there's some more marbles coming down now. And if they go the other way, not over the bridge, but hopefully... Yes, this one here. Look, let's follow this one now. It goes the right way, I think. And we're going to follow it under these, through these lights and that little tunnel there. Around the corners... And I think eventually we are going to start getting back towards the beginning of the marble run, which is good because you know what? I've been recording for about four hours at this point and my uh, my video is probably about 9,000 terabytes big. So it's <laughs> so let's try and get to the end of this thing before my computer blows up. But uh, OK, it's going to go onto an escalator there. There it goes out the top of it, look, and it will join onto this bigger track up here. Ah, now that's interesting. So where is this? That is coming off under that big bridge there. These are where they will join up. There's the escalator. They're going to join up over here. Go inside this rock there. It's a bit like a secret passage, isn't it? But just before we go into this secret cave here, I've got something amazing to show you. Right, now I'm going to show you something amazing, okay? So we're going to go back to the heart here and over to the yellow side just over there because we haven't been through that yet, have we? So let's go in. Let's follow this marble here. And, uh, okay, let's just zoom through here and see what's on the other side of the tunnel. At the top of the screen, you can see the yellow house where we just went into. And on the left is the exit of the yellow tunnel, okay? So we've just come out of there. And look what happens, though. They go underneath that building with all the bounce pads in that we saw earlier. It's going to go under those tracks. Let's go down here with these two marbles and see what happens to them when they go inside the rock just through there. Look, now, guys, this is going to be amazing, okay? We better zoom forwards a bit. There's a spinner in here. But the next thing on this track is unbelievable. Unbelievably cool. Look at this as we come out the tunnel on the other side. There's 
a massive drop and there's that big orange bridge in the background but look at the size of that ski ramp guys it's a huge ski ramp there's a yellow marble going off it right now look how much height it gets guys that's amazing some of them don't <laughs> do so well as they leave the end of it i think they sort of get a bit of friction on the end and don't go too high here's a green one now let's see how well that one does and that is a good jump right there oh, oh my goodness guys what happened to that one it went a bit crazy but look it goes down the end under that big orange bridge and into a house at the end here's another view a pink marble on that ramp and it goes all the way down there we're just going to position ourselves at the end of the ramp whoa guys they're launched off the end super fast here's another one guys they're going so quickly off the ramp there we go here we go whoa Here's another one. We're going to follow this down now. Whoa, there it goes. We're going to follow it down and see where they all go at the end of this jump and the slope here. Okay, so into some nails. They're going to make their way through those into a red house at the end. Now, let's go through this. There's the yellow gate. I think that's the sort of end of the yellow section from the heart. So we'll just go through here. There's some trees, another track. And you can see here it sort of ends up on this track joining with other marbles as well. There's an escalator over there. And that's actually where the green heart goes to, isn't it? So all of these marbles, the yellow and the green ones, eventually join together and go into this secret cave down here. Oh, now what's happening? Oh, there's a funnel here. Loads of marbles in this room. Okay, there's another marble over there. Look, on a different track underneath. Let's see where this goes. Maybe that's where it goes, actually. Pull these marbles through here. Uh, through the roadblocks there. I wonder what that is. Um, <laughs> let's follow these ones round. This is a big tunnel, isn't it? A really big cave. Okay, so there's a lantern up there. There's been some miners in here working away with their pickaxes, I think. Let's go down the center. And there's a hole here. Okay, so, oh, wow, a ring, a gold ring. Okay, through there. Ah, now this, we're coming out here. Oh, no, guys, there's a big pile up of marbles. They, they've got stuck, look. Oh, no, they've got stuck. Uh, oh, ooh, this is interesting. Right, now this is near the end of the run, I think. Look, there's the car park, yes. Okay, so we're near the end of the run. Now here comes some marbles which make it through, overtaking the green one there. Now some of them can go down the left, some of them along the right. So let's sort of have a look at both of those at the same time if we can. Ah, now those ones look go through the car park. Now that's interesting. So they're going to go across the train tracks in a minute, I think. Let's follow them round. There they go. Whoa, they're jumping over the barriers, guys. That's a bit, that's a bit naughty, isn't it? But uh, <laughs> I don't think they'll get any fines or tickets for that. I think they'll be okay. They've lost a bit of speed here, but they all that they get boosted over here. Let's watch this green one. It's going to get boosted in a minute, and it's going to blast off down the track underneath the train. Okay, oh, this is that tunnel we saw earlier underneath the bridge, look. So it's going to go through there. Loads more marbles coming round now. Through these nails, alongside the train on the right-hand side, making their way through this mini obstacle course here. And, oh, lots of marbles are getting stuck, actually. But they can get knocked into and set free. And there's the garage. Yes, we made it round at the beginning, actually. Oh, hang on, there's a jump here. Now, we haven't seen that track yet, have we? There's a jump on the right-hand side. And that goes, oh, this is interesting, into a forest. Okay, there's actually, yeah, ah. Now there's an escalator here, taking them up to the top of a mountain, I think. Let's go up here then. There they are. Oh, this is, oh, that's a bit scary. Look at that. It goes inside a skull. Let's follow these ones then and see... Guys, this is amazing. Oh, I, know, I remember this. We saw this at the beginning, didn't we? This is really cool. This is that big water slide, guys. Check that out. There's a water slide. Should we roll down it in camera mode? Let's choose the lava marble camera mode. I'm going to roll down it. Three, two, one, go. Right, here we are then. Oh, this is going to be amazing. I'll zoom in a little bit here. There's a skull on the side. Okay, okay. Please don't blow up. Don't blow up my computer, please. <laughs> oh, this is good. Okay, uphill. Bit of a jet of water there boosting us forwards. And we're going to... Oh, goodness me. The frames are dropping. It's probably about 10 FPS. And down a really... Oh, that's really fast. Up the sides. We just... We hit something there. But we're still going. Okay, there's some spikes on the side of it. Oh, that might be a, another sort of skeleton there. But uh, we're exiting now onto a track. Oh, my goodness. Okay, round the corner. 
And uh, yes, now through a tunnel here. Okay, now this is quite interesting actually, isn't it? Oh no, okay, there's a big switch track there. Oh, there's the bay. Oh, wow, guys. Oh, yes, we're going through the village or the town here. Look. Oh, that's how you get there. Okay, so we're going to just go around here and make our way down into the buildings. Let's go first person mode. Oh, my goodness. Through the buildings. Whoa. <laughs> guys, the performance is so... Oh, down the steps. Down the steps. Okay, now we're carrying along next to the beach there and the sun lounges. Uphill on the other side of the town. Now, I wonder where this goes then. I haven't seen this before. Oh, look, it's going back around to the beginning, I think. We're very close now to the train tracks. We're going to jump up onto the track through the... Oh, there we go. Look, we've just been here a minute ago, haven't we? And we're going to go through the nails again. Let's just come out of camera mode there. Down the end. And back round to the garage again where we started at the very beginning. Back here you might remember we went to the right hand side last time where that switch just flipped but there's another marble coming in a minute and we're going to see that actually going on the left hand side and we'll see where that track goes. There it is right now just underneath us going through the tunnel round the corner and hopefully it's going to go left. Is it? Uh, yes it's gone left. Okay let's follow it. The switch has just gone as well so let's follow it now round to the left here. And what it's going to do is make its way down along the water side and eventually join back with the other track as well. But we'll just follow it through and see what happens there. So past all the sun loungers down at the bottom of the town here. And uh, it's going to make its way uphill on the other side. And then around the corner and here, look, it joins on with this merger track. Both sides, left and right, are going to join on together and continue down the grassy routes and then back around at the start line again. Here's a bird's eye view of that town area. And doesn't it look exactly like a real racetrack because all those marbles are going zooming around it? It's so awesome, isn't it? There was also another track down here, wasn't there? On the right-hand side through that tunnel over there. We just went left onto that car park route over there, didn't we? Where those marbles are going right now but we're going to go down the right hand side and just see where that ends up okay so we'll just come down here and join those marbles on their way around through the tunnel which i love that's super cool isn't it oh there's a ramp over here there's a small rainbow ramp oh this white marble's going to hit it right now and it gets a bit of a boost as it goes over the jump let's follow it round and see where these ones end up okay so we're going to come around the corner here oh that's nice look at that it's like a giant sort of log inside a rock <laughs> and it goes all the way through through to the other end where it opens up again. Oh, there's the train. That's cool. Okay, so we've just come out near the train. We're, of course, heading back to the beginning now, I think, because this is where we joined on earlier from the car park. Look at that marble jumping over there. And uh, that's the dog marble. And they're joining on with these marbles right now. I've just found another track which we haven't seen yet, actually. Do you remember over here? We have seen this funnel here before, right? They go down there. And then, earlier on, I had a look at this box over here. And I said, I wonder what that is, I think. But that is another track, actually. Last time, we just went over there through the barriers. But this time, we're going to follow some marbles through here, past the box, and see where it leads to. And actually, this place is amazing. Here it is. Okay, now inside this cave is a huge interior space. A bit like the other one we saw earlier. Look at the size of that spinning cog over there. It starts off with a spiral here underneath that crystal on the ceiling of this cave. And they come around the corner. Here's one now. Just watch it go around there. It goes up this sort of lift thing where I suppose they're lifting up, you know, stuff they've mined. Uh, and they're sort of carrying it right up to the top of this hill. We'll take a step back here so we can see the whole room all in one go. And as you can see, they go around that spiral in the background and then they're going to come up this slope here. But look how much stuff is actually inside. We've got loads of equipment, forklift trucks and sort of rail cars and all sorts of things. Loads of mine carts full of what looks like gold actually. I think they're mining gold in here. Here comes the marble now. So it's going to come along there, look, go up the hill and into the next section because yes, there is actually another section just through here. So let's carry on. There's a moving block here, which is kind of just knocking into marbles. And here is the next section now. Oh, God, oh no, there's bombs here. <gasps> Whoa. Okay, hang on a minute. Now, Whoa, that was a big explosion. There's loads of bombs coming down here. That is the cannon. And it's blasting big bombs all the way down the track. We'll follow the next one. Look, you can follow it as it rolls down there around the spiral here underneath the track. And then it exploded around here. Here comes a marble now, but I think it's going to escape the explosions, luckily. Yes, it got through unscathed. And then they're going to go through this track here, through the nails, 
outside and this you're going to recognize because if we just zoom out a bit you'll see that actually it goes right back round to the start again that's the cave exit just over there where the marbles are coming out of it splits into two different tracks but they all actually meet up at the same point eventually so they're going to come around here look and join up over here there's sort of a couple of t-junctions actually they all actually join onto this track which goes alongside the train and we saw this just a minute ago so they're going to roll through there of course and back round to the start line again i almost forgot to do that track guys we're probably going to miss a couple of things on this track just because it is so big and i'm not sure i'll actually find everything but i do know that i've actually missed a really awesome waterfall and water rapids track over here guys this is completely separate and it's amazing let's check it out the marbles are actually Actually going to get to roll down all of these waterfalls. I've just got to show you this guys there's a river rapids here so I'm spawning in tons of marble oh my goodness that's a bit too many look how many marbles we've got that's 644 let's just uh, zoom out a bit here now these things are going to go down a river rapids right down the mountain and we're just going to follow them down there's a big waterfall on the left hand side we're going to go underneath a bridge with those vehicles on let's just zoom down here and uh, try and catch up with them a bit guys this is amazing it's not part of the main track. It's actually a separate decorational piece, I think. But over here, look at this. They're all crowding up as they try to get their way. They're forcing their way through those rocks there, the narrow gaps, and trying to get down through the trees as well. Wind, look at that zigzagging and winding through these rocks here, bumping into that one in the middle. And uh, they're going to split off actually into two separate lanes and then go back into the same piece of river again under a log past a house here on the right. And uh, this is amazing, isn't it? <laughs> I just, I love this marble run through the gaps here. Let's try and get down to their level a bit and see from their perspective what this is like. We're going to zoom through the rocks here, try and catch up with the front runners around the corner. Now up above, look, there is part of the main marble track, but we're going to go underneath it through the supports go through there and uh, eventually I think they uh, look here we go there's a big sort of pool at the bottom but eventually they're going to come off that track and make their way around the side through the trees along the side of the train track and into the rock over here now through there there's actually a teleporter look how many trees there are guys we're actually underneath some of the track I think now those marbles are going to disappear into that teleporter and they're going to go back to where we started a minute ago look how many are coming through there's loads if we go up here and you can see those marbles there they're still coming around this river of course because they've gone back to the start again if we follow them all the way back there there's the docks on the left hand side and you can still see them up here look how many marbles are coming down here guys they're still rolling down in full force <gasps> oh there's a water they're riding on the waterfall i didn't know they could do that before anyway what they're doing is actually coming out of this teleporter up here that's where we spawned them in and uh, of course there's the teleporter you can see them jumping out underneath that bridge but yeah i didn't realize they can actually go down the waterfalls as well let's go over here now where are they coming from oh they're coming from up this one as well there's actually a skateboard ramp here as well by the way just casually on the side of the map and look how big it is it goes all the way from down here that's the end of it it goes all of the way up there it's not even part of the main marble run and look how huge it is and i've just realized something the marbles are actually coming all of the way up here out of this teleporter as well. So they're actually rolling down the entire side from the very corner of the map. Look, that's the very corner of it if I just zoom out a bit. They're actually rolling down the entire side of this skateboard ramp. There's one doing a jump over there. We'll just zoom out again and as you can see, they're actually they're coming from over here as well. Look at that. That's interesting, isn't it? They're coming out of all these different teleporters, but eventually joining together, I guess. There's a space buggy on this one. Again, zooming out, and yes, they're going to eventually end up on these big waterfalls going into the plunge pools down there. And uh, yeah, they'll make their way down and join all together near the beginning. And that is just another incredible feature on this marble run. We've seen, you know, pretty much the entire track, bar a few things we've probably missed here and there because it's so big. But there's actually a secret area. And I'm pretty sure nobody is able to guess where it is because it's not anywhere near this thing. It's actually up there <laughs> it's up in the sky it's so high and far away that you can't even see it from down here but i'm not joking there is actually another marble run 
up there as well and it's actually quite big guys unfortunately there's a lot of flashing lights and colors and speckle and things like that and i'm not sure that i'm able to actually show that on screen because it might affect some people who are sensitive to those sorts of things however what i'm going to do is show you where it is we're actually going to zoom away from that insane map okay and we're going to try and find oh, there it is you see that on the corner of the screen there's a whole bunch of stars if you look at it you can't see it but at the corner of the screen you can now it's inside a really dark enclosure with lots of stars all over it basically in this big object here there is a giant marble run on screen i'm probably showing you a couple of images of that right now but as soon as i move the camera it's going to get pretty intense on the eyes and for that reason i'm not going to do it but this is what it looks like that was fantastic wasn't it it's got to be the biggest and the most detailed marble run that we've that we've seen on the channel so far let's come down here to the bay shall we have a nice sort of chilled out outro to this video let's go into the house let's see if we can just you know take a step up here and uh you know that's pretty cool isn't it the view on this house but let's go inside there through the door ah oh, back home again safe and sound and look that's it really cool actually because you can see the run through the windows <laughs> that is guys this is so awesome anyway thank you so much for watching everybody i really appreciate it if you did enjoy it please do hit the subscribe button the like button and ring the bell if you want to be notified of when my upcoming videos release thank you so much take care and i'll see you in the next one bye for now